Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to day five of um, Football Army Week. Hope you're liking the week. Hope you're liking your half term if you're on your half term. So yeah, so today is the foot uh, my football prediction for the weekend game. So it's the FA Cup the weekend. So there's eight games in the FA Cup um, this weekend. I want to go for my football prediction, who I think is going to win. And yeah, so uh, so uh, there's eight games. Um, obviously the weekend. The first one's Arsenal versus Hull. Arsenal's obviously uh, the winner of um, the FA Cup the last two years. I feel they could probably go to the final again. So I think um, Arsenal's going to win 3-0. They're at home against Hull. And I'm pretty sure they're not Hull at the last three years and played Hull in the final uh, two years ago. So um, I reckon 3-0 Hull. 3-0 uh, Arsenal. Um, they're going to rest a few players because of the Champions League. So um, yeah, so I reckon 3-0 Arsenal on that one. The second game is Reading versus West Brom. West, West Brom has not really had the great season. I've not really rated their performances. They've not really been fantastic with the Barrow Hino situation. And uh, Reading, it could be the cup team this year. You, you, every year you always have a cup um, team that always at least gets to the semi finals. So um, I reckon Reading's going to win 2 1. At, um, they're at home as well, so 2 1 against West Brom. The third game is uh, Watford versus Leeds. Um, I reckon um, Leeds, you, you, they often do the uh, big upsets, but I reckon Watford's got the quality to beat them. So I reckon it could be a tight game, but 1-0 Watford. Uh, the next game is um, a Premier League clash between Bournemouth and Everton. Everton seems to be one of the top uh, goal-scoring teams this season, uh, with Lukaku on form, De La Feu, uh, some so many of their players doing well, so I reckon it's gonna be a very tight game again. But Bournemouth, I reckon they're gonna be more focused on the league, staying up, getting points in the league. Rest, I need to rest a few players because there's a lot of games coming up. So I reckon there could be um, an Everton one nil away in that one. And the next game is um, Blackburn versus West Ham. Obviously, um, the replay was West Ham and Liverpool. And West Ham won through penalties, so uh, through um, Ogbonna scoring in the last minute. So, um, Blackburn at home on this, um, they haven't really got a fantastic team in my opinion. Not really doing fantastic in the uh, championship. So, um, and uh, I reckon West Ham can look on to even, maybe even win the FA Cup this year. Especially going to Olympic Stadium next year. And winning the FA Cup, going to Olympic Stadium, it's not really bad for them. So I reckon um, West Ham could do a 3-1 away win there. Uh, the next game is Tottenham Crystal Palace, the London derby there. Not the biggest London derby, but it's uh, Tottenham uh, Palace. Tottenham doing well in the league. I don't like saying that, but they are doing well in the league. As long as Arsenal finish above them, I don't really matter to me, but as long as Arsenal finish above them. Um, I reckon it'll be a tight game. Tottenham probably risk a couple of their players. Um, um, Palace are struggling with scoring, but I reckon it could be a 1 1 draw um, in that one, so that could go to a replay. Uh, the next game is um, the uh, it'll be on a uh, Saturday evening, I think. This no, it'll be a Sunday e uh, late kickoff. That one, I reckon. This one is uh, Chelsea Man City. That's the big, the biggest clash in this um, FA Cup fifth round. So, um, so one of the big boys we go in there. Um, Chelsea picking up a bit of form. Um, haven't lost underneath. Um, the new manager now, so uh, Man City had a dip in form, lost against Leicester, got lost against Tottenham, and Pellegrini is probably not in the um, mindset because he knows he's going to be leaving at the end of the season. So I reckon um, Chelsea probably go all wet because they probably want to go and win the FA Cup because that's the only thing they can win realistically. I don't think they will do well in the Champions League. So um, I reckon a Chelsea 2 1, it'd be a close, I reckon it'd be a tight game you obviously got Aguero I reckon both teams will put out the big players their first team a couple of youngsters but they still play a lot of their main players because they've been in the Champions League in a week but I feel they probably both would, win, would want to win the uh, FA Cup and the final game with the lowest ranked team left in the competition Shrewsbury at home against Manchester United as much as I love the upsets of the um the uh, underdogs winning all the time. Oh, I love the underdogs winning. So, uh, but Shrewsbury, I think Van Gaal probably also won the FA Cup. Many of the teams left in the competition, 
they would want to win the FA Cup. But with Van Gaal, I think he's got uh, a point to prove in everyone saying he's not a great manager, uh, he's not doing well in Man United. I think he's been a great manager. I think the Man United team's not great at all. Rooney's not performed. Martial's probably their best player. And the defence is diabolical, art, in my opinion. And uh, De Gea's obviously saved them. They, they could even be mid-table now if De Gea weren't there. If he didn't go to Real Madrid, I don't know. They could be in a difficult situation. So I would like Shrewsbury to win, but in my head, I think um, Man United would win. So, yeah, so that's um, my predictions for this weekend's game. Um, obviously, all my predictions will be in the uh, description or if you've like, missed a bit, um, so all my uh, predictions and that. So, if you do um, predictions and that, take my thought in, um, in mind. I reckon that will be so. Obviously, I'll go through it again. So, an Arsenal win, Reading win, Watford win, Everton win, a West Brom win, a Crystal Palace and Tottenham draw, Chelsea win, and a Man United win. So, yeah, so they'll be going through. I reckon they're the teams that will be going through to the next round. In the Tottenham and Crystal Palace replay, I hope Crystal Palace beat Tottenham. But if Tottenham go far in a cup, hopefully they won't do well in the league. So, um, yeah, that's my fault in mind because I'm an Arsenal fan and I don't want Tottenham to win. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so I hope you like my football prediction. Obviously, I'll be uh, doing a video on Sunday, hope for my final video for the Football One will week on Sunday. To see how I got on in the uh, final video and uh, that. So yeah, so I um, hope you liked it. I hope you like on my videos far, so far this week. And remember, I'm gonna be, I'll be uploading tomorrow again with a, a another video about one o'clock. And uh, yeah, so keep a look out and see if I'll get my uh, results right. And yeah, um, all the links to social media to play will be down below in the description. And yeah, have a good weekend. See you later. Bye.